Hello everybody, good morning to you, welcome to Tuesday morning. Whenever you drive down the road and look to the left or to the right, you see a construction project going on and you're automatically you think, I wonder what they're building. I wonder what they're constructing. And so you may even guess as to what they're doing. Hey, that's gonna be a bank or that's gonna be a fast food restaurant. Uh, somebody's new house and it looks nice already uh, it's going to be spectacular you can just kind of see a project they kind of guess as to what they're doing well we're all building we're building our lives we love to have a strong family and so we build up our family we we like to have a strong marriage and so we build our marriage so that it's solid and strong maybe it's a financial portfolio you are trying to to build up and uh, or whatever it is whatever it is we're all building something uh, the Bible talks about people that that build on things that don't really matter you know and they build with wood hay and stubble and and so when the storm comes those things are going to be blew away they're going to be tossed around and so it is imperative to build on the rock it's imperative to build on a solid foundation it's imperative to have a good roof and good walls and and to use the right materials and the same can be said about our own lives in general what are you building on are you building on things that don't really matter are you focused on a construction project that you know what when the first wind comes are you focused on a construction project that when the first wind comes it's going to blow it all away or are you building on a particular project in your life that it really doesn't matter. I mean, it, 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 it may seem like it matters now, but in the scope of life in general, it doesn't matter. I have heard it said, and I'll say it again to you today, what really lasts is anything you do for the Lord, any investment that you pour into the kingdom of God, anything you do for God, that's all that's going to really last. Everything else can be burned up or blew away or rust, or a thief's going to come in and steal but if you do your best to construct things in the kingdom of God and, and build and invest in the kingdom of God, then that's what's going to matter. That's what's going to matter. What you do for the Lord, that's what's going to last. So every prayer you pray, every dollar you put in the offering, every, every kind gesture you do, every time you exhibit the fruit of the Spirit, every time you do anything at all, for the kingdom of God, then you're building, you're building something that is going to last and withstand and truly matter. And of course, right now, if you've been born again, if you are living for the Lord, then Jesus himself is building something. The Bible talks about him building a mansion, a mansion. In my father's house are many mansions. If it were not so, I would have told you so, Jesus said. I go to prepare a place for you that where I am there, ye may be also. What are you building today? Well, if you're right with the Lord, living for the Lord, Jesus is building you a place, a, an eternal place, a place in heaven. And isn't that what really matters? Your eternity? Yeah, right now matters, but, but really thinking about long term what really really matters is that you are right with the lord and that you make heaven your home god bless you thank you for watching god with the pastor everybody appreciate you have a great tuesday